will tell about uh, hyperspadias patient information. So normally you have a um, penis like that and the meatus is at the tip and also the penis is straight and you have the scrotum like this. So this is the where the testicles are there. So two stretches are like that. In a patient with hypers and the, the, the skin is complete. Normally the skin is complete like this. You have a complete skin which goes all around like that. So in a patient with the hyperspadias, what happens is the skin is not complete like that. That is number one. And then number two, the opening is not in the place where it should be. So the opening instead of being there, what happens is the opening is a little down. So then what happens? This area and this area, everything is looking a little bent, bent downwards. So what happens is the entire penis is bent and sometimes the, even the scrotum is like holding on to it like that. So the scrotum itself can be like that and then it can be tethering. In addition, the skin is also only on the top. Then there can also be a bent in the penis. The normal penis is straight. The normal penis is straight and then the foreskin is complete. Whereas in hyperspadias, this penis is bent and then the opening is under there. So the glands is like that and the entire skin, instead of coming it completely, it is all on the top. So this is how the opening is. So when the patient passes urine, the urine comes downwards. When the penis gets erect, it is bent. So this bent as well as the opening, both have to be corrected when we do the 